Welcome back everybody to another Off-Road Outlaws Random Builds video. Hope y'all are doing great today because today we got another pre-runner slash Baja build coming y'all's way. And I think this time it's a pretty good one. I've been kind of slacking on the wraps lately. I've been doing a lot worse than I used to do. So I think it's time I try and do a lot better. Because I need to. <laughs> so we got a nice looking pre-runner here. That I spent a little bit of time on. I think it turned out great. What do y'all think? Let me know down in the comments below. And well, let's get straight into it. Didn't do a crazy amount here. The front bumper stayed stock. Fenders, didn't touch them. Rear bumper, I chose the last option. Bed type, didn't touch it. Cage, didn't touch it. I wish there was an interior cage for all vehicles. Now running boards is the last option. Because the running board that comes with it is kind of weird. And for the roof light, you've got the fourth option. No snorkels. Spare wheel, I do have it, but it's quite weird. Eh, let's go ahead and put it there. I'm just kidding. We ain't putting it there. It'll, it'll cover up. So, I mean, let's just leave it there and just pretend that they're both separated. And the horns didn't do anything with it. Windshield protection. Didn't use it. Front light. Did add that. Because, yeah. Why not? Got a winch. Don't got a jack. Because, yeah. Exhaust pipes. Didn't do anything with them. Left them the same. Headlights changed them to the second option. Didn't do anything with the gun rack. Repair pack is, yeah, always... And mirrors stay the same. So that's about everything right there. Now I want to work on this a little bit. So we got this. One, two, three. And let's tilt. Let's go over. Let's go about right there. That'd be a good one. And now flag two. One, two, three. And then, um, what was the other one's tilt? About right there. About right there. Nice. And now for it. Doing it. Wrong button. There we go. Eh, you know what? I still think it's a size too big. Yeah, that looks better. Now, let's try some of these now. Let's do that. And for antenna... Interesting place, and there's nothing there. Let's go all the way up to the front. Actually, you know what? Just give me an idea. Let's go back to this. Let's go back to the toolbox. Let's do that. Because I've seen some toolboxes like this. Actually, we have a toolbox like this. Um, let's go back to flags. Let's go back to antenna. Let's uh, go up let's go about right here so let's go back up for a little bit about right there let's do antenna length about right there and I don't think we need that right now let's put a red light up there enable that and do that yeah we do red there you go nice turned out great now the rest of the antenna needs to be like that perfect <laughs> and then you see the rims that we got we got a beadlock we got the metallic black 
Got that rim type and the beads are on. And the tires are those types. And nothing used there, but we did use a crap, crap ton there. So this line was back here to do that. And then you got the this thing for that. You got this to cover up the fact that there is, well, some right there. And then you got this up right there. Get this up here to make that black all through there. Which I think turned out pretty great. Same on that side, same on that. A little piece over here too to make it more flat across there. And then you got this down here. And you got this that goes over it. You got the black back here, which blends the tailgate in. And then you got these up here, which have been interlaced a little to make it look pretty cool. And the the big Pro Charge logo over there. The Holly 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 Speed Demon. Got more of the black stuff. And then you got the four by four, the Alfred Outlaws, and then the rest of these up here. Which all turned out great. <sighs> okay. If I exit, I gotta redo everything. Uh, let's just apply it. I don't really see much that was messed up other than this little thing right here. And it's already fixed. Nice. Don't need to go back in there though. Now, upgrades, you got everything. Not diesel. Don't got manual. And you don't got an e-brake. Because e-brakes don't like me. But then again, probably should get it for this. And I have turbo for this because I haven't used turbo in a long time. Other than doing diesel builds. I haven't used it on a gas vehicle in a long time. So... Why not use it? And now for tuning. We got all this stuff. Got the trophy type. And then known to the suspension tuning. Axe width is point zero two. Damping thirty six ten. Shocks zero. Need to change that to one. Shock size, I'm gonna go one point eight. Stiffness twenty four thousand nine hundred. Travel 0.25. Now rear, axis width 0 0.04, damping 3610, rear steering nada. Shocks 1, shock size, I'm going to do that, 1.8. Stiffness 24,900, and travel 0.29. There you go with that. Now wheels and tires, rim size, just stock, radius. At the two dots with Did really change that's front and back my gear tuning. Fix my mic there. Now gear tuning. First gear two point nine, second one point five, third one point one, fourth zero point nine, fifth zero point seven, and low is two point oh. Now, Dino Run is perfect set. Everything's perfect set. Dropping this thing. It's pretty good. Maybe got a little bit that I can change on this. But other than that, it's a very good, solid built vehicle. And I think it should help y'all a lot if y'all are going to like a little bit of races in the game or something, doing a little race. Should have a good time with it. And hope y'all enjoyed this because I don't got much time to make a video. I'm trying to get another custom map video done. And as you all saw earlier, just like a few seconds ago, the audio is not on my side today. So, I hope you all enjoy, and I will see you all next time. Bye-bye, everybody.